Hi everyone. Happy New Year. We made it. I am Teal Cher and this is New Mobility Live, a monthly interview series where I connect with others in the disability community and share those conversations with you. My guest is Andrea Dalzell, also known as the Seated Nurse. Andrea is New Mobility's 2020 Person of the Year. And you can read all about that in our current issue, which is available now at newmobility.com. But first, here is our chat. Hi, Andrea. Hi. First off, congratulations on being New Mobility's 2020 Person of the Year. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. <laughs> so in 2020, you worked the front lines of the pandemic. You were awarded the Craig H. Nielsen's $1 million visionary prize. And you recently started a foundation to help bridge the gap between education and employment for those with physical disabilities. Yes. What is something you learned about yourself that you're carrying with you into this new year? I think it's the same lesson that I have kind of carried with me throughout my entire life was just don't doubt yourself, right? Like the moment that doubt creeps in, things kind of fade away. You're, you're insecure. Your confidence goes down. Everything becomes a burden versus just taking things one step at a time figuring out answers and just having this yes mentality and knowing that things are possible and you just have to figure out how the moving pieces come together. That's it. As a wheelchair user, mm -hmm. I um, experience my fair share of awkward experiences. Uh, for example, I was at the grocery store recently and the checkout guy looked at me and said, don't worry, when you die, God will heal you and you'll be able to walk again. And <laughs> so I was wondering if uh, you have an awkward moment story that you'd be willing to share with us. Ooh, okay, funny story for all. Um, when I first started working COVID unit. And I know that's like, oh my goodness, oh my COVID, nobody's going to think this is funny. When I first started work, working COVID, the nurses didn't think that I would be able to lift or move patients in the bed. Mind you, I have taken up boxing and have been training for over three years. So of course I can move someone. I, they don't know this though. So now I'm in the room and I'm helping with a patient and I'm like, okay, let's pull them up in bed. And they're like, oh, we'll find someone else. It's okay. And I'm like, no, no, it's okay. And they're like looking at me, well, we don't think you can do it because, you know, your chair. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure I'd be able to get this person up in bed with or without you. And they're like, oh, we'll go get someone else. No worries. So they left the room and I literally pushed the bed forward, pulled his whole um, bed sheets all the way up. So he was in bed, tucked and got him back up before they even got back in the room. Yeah. And their jaws, their whole face was like, And it was just like, no worries, guys. I got to go to the next patient. And I'm like, I left them no there. Deal. I got stuff to do. <laughs> yeah, no worries. Bye. But that awkward sense of, you just told me I couldn't do something. Yeah. I just did it on my own because even though I know you need two people, I'm fine. I don't need this. I, I got to go with other, got other things to do instead of wasting my time here. But to see their facial expression, that, <gasps> yeah. I was like, yeah. battle. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's great. I am a big fan of your Instagram account, The Seat Nurse. Yes. And uh, for fun, I like to scroll down and look at people's very first post. And yours is from June 8th, 2013. Um, tell us a little <laughs> bit about what's going on. So I think I had just gone water skiing for the first time. Yeah. And June 8th, 2013 means that I was still thinking if I was going to go back to school. I had been out of college now for about four years at that time. And I was struggling with how do I go back to college? How do I fund it? Can I get back in and, and do good and, and figure out academics? And I think going water skiing for the first time was that 
aha moment. Like I just conquered water and I don't even know how to swim. So therefore I want to go conquer college. Uh, and your foundation is called the seated position. The seated position. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And you just tell us like a little bit about it. Sure. So the seated position was created in order to help those who have either been born with their disability or acquired a disability later in life, uh, get the skills that they need to enter the workforce. So a lot of students are always pushed into just doing social work or psychology. Um, they're not often given the chances to get into acting or get into healthcare or get into art. And I think it's extremely important to start bridging those gaps and finding corporations that are willing to come out and, and help build those skill sets for people with disabilities across the nation. I'm starting small and only in New York, mm -hmm. but the goal will be to find enough uh, organizations and companies to help build a, a solid skill set pull from so that people with all different disabilities can come and say, I would love to learn this and we can partner them with a company and get them the skill set that they're looking for. To wrap up, is there anything upcoming that we should know about or that you would like to plug? Um, there's a couple things down the list. Uh, watch out for maybe me and a character from Grey's Anatomy. <gasps> maybe. Okay. Like maybe. on the TV? Like we'll see. Um, maybe. Or we don't know. May, we don't know. We don't know. We can't talk. We'll just, just be on the lookout for look in out. a Grey's Anatomy action <laughs> character. That's a good, that's a good tease. I'm intrigued. Just a little hint. Just a little hint. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, Andrea, yes. thank you so much for being here. You're my very first guest and I appreciate I'm it. So and thank you everybody for watching um please check out january's new mobility issue um 2020 person of the year andrea is on the cover she's in the <laughs> magazine and please follow her online twitter facebook or instagram um at the seated nurse thank you guys so much teal thank you for having me thank you for being here Bye. <laughs> Thank you.